Hey. Hi, I'm the fallen angel Christopher Daniels, an inspiration to children everywhere, a national treasure. You're watching Dre Gaming 41. Dre 41 Gaming, my man. home of the famous dungeon. I swear, I can almost hear the wrestlers of the past groaning in pain. <laughs> I just want to say, I know I've been a little skeptical, but now that we're here, I can see us doing this. I mean, once Bret Hart hears how far we drove, he's going to have no choice but to welcome us right in for training. So thanks for pushing me on this. Of course. Well, here we go. <laughs> Hey there, I bet you're here for Bret Hart, eh? Uh, hello, uh, and yes. Is that his wife black? Happy wrestlers, eh? I'm not sure I'm using that correctly. Is Bret home right now? He is. Hang on a sec. Bret, two lovely people are here for wrestling training. He'll be right down. I'm sure he's just putting his tights on, gelling up his hair, finding his sunglasses. He's got to look the part, you know. Of course. So are you Bret's... A housekeeper? Okay, seriously, guys? I'm messing with you. So, Brett's not home? No. And he hasn't been for years. The hearts don't live here anymore. But oh, wow. Said... This kind of thing happens like once a month. And I like to have a little fun when I break the news. How is that fun? We just spent three days driving here. And I gave myself severe stomach issues. At this point, we'd settle for one of the more obscure Hart brothers or even a distant cousin. Like I said, none of them are here. You seem like nice kids. Stupid, but nice. Next time, do some research before you decide to drive all the way up here. Jeez. Ah! So much for Canadian. <laughs> I thought you said you checked all this out online. I did. I mean, I searched for dungeon in wrestling, and then some really weird stuff came up, and I kind of got sidetracked. Point being, don't look at my browser history. Hey! We came all the way here. We should at least get a picture. Eh, can we do another one? I was making a weird face. Probably on account of the stomach pain. Maybe you were right about us trying to become wrestlers. We've already failed at the first thing on our list. And maybe we're not cut out for this. Hey, wait, we can't just give up that easily. Maybe. I have an idea. Developers did. <laughs> so you drove all the way to Calgary thinking you were going to train with Bret Hart? I've done some stupid stuff in my life, but that takes the cake. <laughs> it wasn't our finest moment. Yeah, it was pretty dumb. Once I had a dad who only looked at the rewards section on the credit card bill. We were able to stay in Calgary and learn from a former wrestler who, at least according to him, trained with the Hearts back in the day. I think he just ran next to one on a treadmill once. So that's how you guys hooked up with Riley Flash. Yeah. After striking out at the dungeon, it was kind of our only option. Even though Riley can be a bit much sometimes, he gave us the foundation we needed to get here today. He also right. gave us ringworm with his dirty mats, but that's a... Ugh! Okay, mixed tag it is. Let's let's get it. Um, oh, do we do tag team moves? Move, you stupid jerk! Oh, we do a double team. Oh, that's whack. That's oh, what's this? Wait a minute. Uh oh, double suplexy. Look at homeboy with the Zubaz and the shiny Ribera sh uh, jacket. Oh. Ooh, good one. Oh, out the ring I go. Get up. Get up. Get up. Really? You gonna buns me out like this? There we go. What the? Wait a minute. Is this like... Oh, okay. I thought it was copying like what we were doing. Yo, she getting her boots smoked over there. I gotta go help. Will I get disqualified in training? <laughs> what? Hit her! Oh! Alright, El Maggio. Guess it's me and you, brother. I wanted to hit her, but I guess that ain't happen. Come on, get in up. Get up, get up, get up, get up, showtime. Get up, get up. 
Okay, off the ropes. There we go. Sweet clothesline. Honestly, the developers could have did a little bit more with El Magio. Like, that's that's a bit ridiculous, guys. Like, y'all being lazy, yo. For real. Like, it's ridiculous. Ooh, powerbomb. Like this. Yada da da. Yaka da. I'm going to keep El Magio in here. Or Mago. Whatever. Luchador Express. Whoever. Yo, I am slow, bruh. I am molasses right now. No, no, we're not going to do that, sir. Take that. Where I'm at, 49%. Ugh. Ugh. There we go. Look at the little dust particles, man. That's that's a good addition. Good addition. You know, got the shiny trophies in the back. I like that. There we go. Get who? Oh, man. All right, whatever. All right. Let's do something here. Oh, I likes it. Come on, what are we gonna do? It better not be like a double suplex. Hey, hey, let's get it. Let's get it. Hey, that's what's up. I like that. I just wish the guys can attack the women and women can attack the guys. That'd be nice. Uh oh. Going for the ride. El Magio, done, bruh. He is finito. I wonder if I could tag what he get in the ring. That would be hilarious, right? Nah, bruh. What are those? Are those like Reeboks he got on? Oh, good forearm shot. Yeah, like, so here's the crazy thing. I was trying to create Tessa Blanchard. Not Tessa, I'm stupid. Um, I was trying to create, um... Britt Baker in the game froze on me. Oh, was I... I was tight. Oh, I was tight. Game crashed, yo, and booted me out. I was like, okay, I see what you're about. Okay, I see you, game. Oh. That's a good reversal. That's... That was stupid. That was dumb, too. Oh. Good judo throw. Okay, we like that. We like it. We like it. We like it, Mikey. We really like it. Oh. Oh, you was doing me filthy on the outside, too, with that. Okay. Okay. No. Hold that. Oh, my God. Bruh. Bruh. Oh. Oh. Oh, good. Horikarana. Let's get it. Now, are we springboarding? No? Lame. How the, how the hell do you get out the ring, bruh? Come here! Wow. Alright, back in the ring, bruh. It's clearly. Move. Move. Sir. Alright, let's get it. Boom. Huge body slam. We love it. Look at all those masks that you can't use in this game. <laughs> wow. What am I doing? Bruh! Who am I taunting to? That's so stupid. Where's the sound? Okay. Wow, he put me in a sleeper. Get your feet up on the turnbuckle. Push off and roll backwards. You can pin him like that. Oh my god, I'm such a lame. I am such a lame. Oh no. <laughs> he put me to sleep. Tap. Oh my god, Joe. I am such a lame. <coughs> such a lame. Yeah, you did good. You did good. Catch your breath. We'll get him next time, alright? You good? <coughs> <sighs> my dude is wild buns. He's a cornball. How how am I, uh. Guys, come here. We need to talk. Yes, we do. I'm in too much good of shape to be getting washed. Is it about your disgusting ring mat? Because I feel like it's making me itch all over. Hey, what was that for? For playing to an imaginary crowd. It cost you the match. Red, great job. Keep it up. Remind me why I show up here every day to get tortured? That's not torture if you're paying for it. Now, what I didn't tell you was that match was actually a tryout. 
For what? Is WWE coming to town? Not quite. It was a tryout for the local Winterfest that's coming up. The organizers asked me to put on a wrestling event. That's great. Who are we gonna face? I wouldn't mind a rematch against those two. Slow down. After what I just saw, only one of you was ready for their first official match. Sorry, Red. You'll get your chance soon. Uh, Red's the one who's ready, not you, doughhead. What? When it comes to in-ring ability, Red's got you beat by a kilometer. Hey. Got less than a mile? Oh, thanks for the conversion, Albert Asswipe. Ha <laughs> ha! You're too focused on the entertainment side of things. <laughs> Maybe you weren't focused enough on the entertainment side of things. Didn't you only appear in WWE like three times? Uh, four, if you count the time I helped carry Macho Man to the ring on his fancy chair gimmick. You mean <laughs> Dan? No, it was a chair, not a car. Either way, I was in WWE four more times than you'll ever be. I'll make it there someday. It's on our list. Oh, yeah, and someday I'm gonna poop golden nuggets. Oh, no offense, Red. Whatever. What? You'll see. Congrats on getting your first match. You know I'll be there cheering you on. Thank Definitely. You. I know. Uh, speaking of cheering her on, since you like running your mouth so much, you can accompany her to the ring as a manager. That actually might be a better fit for you long term. <laughs> manager? <laughs> I'm here for <laughs> Where'd my logos go? I need to know what to call you so they can advertise the event. That's easy. I'm sticking with Red. Kids started calling me that in high school because of my temper, but I'm gonna turn it into something positive. Okay. Man, what about you? Sticking with Denver? Mm, I don't know. Sounds too regional. And Omli. I know. How about uh, Albert Asswipe? Wow. Uh, wow. Botch? On account of all the moves you botch? <laughs> wow. I like that one. How about I pay tribute to my wonderful trainer and call myself Riley Flash Jr.? Oh, that ain't happening. Do you have any other nicknames? <laughs> Trey! No, no, don't listen to her. I kind of like that. And you can spell it T-R-E, so it's kind of like three in Spanish, as in getting a three count to win a match. Which probably won't happen very often for you, but you get it, right? Yeah. Wow. Great. Or you just put like D-R-E. You know? Thanks a lot. No problem, Trey. And hey, I just realized we can cross something off our list. Come up with awesome wrestling names. I don't know about the awesome part. Oh, now I can get into the ring. Right, Unlock some ring. things. Well, that's it for this episode. Like, subscribe, comment. I got more to come. Catch you in the next video. Later.